an awesome idea. And to get that idea launched, you need to raise capital, which is actually really hard. Traditionally, you'd ask a bank or a couple big investors for funding. But banks aren't lending, and they want collateral that you don't have anyway. Big investors? Less than 3 in 100 startups get so lucky. If you really want your idea to get funded, you'll need to tap into your own savings, home equity, and credit cards to contribute nearly half. The rest of the funding will need to come from people like your friends, family, colleagues, and acquaintances. But this economy isn't doing you any favors. You're not alone. Think of how ordinary investors must feel. They experience low returns on savings. And old laws have kept them from getting in on the ground floor of your awesome idea. Don't give up so easily, because new laws have changed all that. Now there's a new way for ordinary people like you to get your awesome ideas funded. It's called investment crowdfunding. So maybe you are familiar with the crowdfunding part. You know, like those social sites that help you raise money through donations, rewards, and advanced purchases. But investment crowdfunding is different because you raise money through investors who now share the risks and rewards of your idea. Rather than trying to pitch your idea to tons of big investors, hoping one will bite, or going into serious debt, investment crowdfunding leverages the internet and social networks to make it possible for you to get small investments from a lot of people who believe in your idea. People who never would have known about your idea before. Pretty cool, huh? So investment crowdfunding is a brand new way to raise capital. Ordinary people like you get your awesome idea funded. And ordinary people like you can invest in great ideas. It's capitalism for the rest of us.